Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Christina, for those of you who are new here. Thanks for clicking on this video. I hope you guys subscribe. I hope you stick around to the end. As you can tell by the title, I'm gonna be reviewing the Shea Moisture Manuka Honey and Yogurt Hydrate and Repair. First product is the Manuka Honey and Yogurt Hydrate and Repair Shampoo. So no sulfates, phthalates, parabens, propylene, glycol, mineral oil, animal testing, or petroleum. Um, it says it cleanses and restores extremely dry, brittle hair. So with this product, they, they all smell really good by the way. Um, it lathers on contact. Like my hair started to lather as soon as this hit my fro, okay? lathers really well it cleanses my hair really well um it's a nice consistency it's not too thick it's not too watery too watery um and it's not drying this i actually do like it does not strip my hair it does cleanse my scalp um i actually really do like it and it will last me a very long time so i'm happy with this product which is the shampoo next product is the conditioner and it's the same claim sulfate free color safe no um parabens mineral oils such ingredients it says it's high it hydrates and restores extremely dry brittle hair from coming back um and i didn't push record so I just applied the conditioner. <laughs> to be completely honest, I don't feel like it hydrated my hair. I don't feel like it moisturized my hair. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't hate it, but I don't like it. Would I purchase it? Absolutely not <clears throat> because it didn't really do anything for my hair nothing at all it didn't like i i just like the smell that's about it that's it i like the smell i'm gonna use it up because it was pretty pricey i think each product was i think this was like over ten dollars for this little container um i use it a few times but i will not repurchase this i had really high hopes for this especially after I used the shampoo I thought this was gonna be bomb especially the way it smelled I was like yes it's gonna be you know lit but no uh no next is the hydrate and repair protein power treatment all of them same claim and stuff I love the way they smell they smell so nice I don't know if you guys can see it's super 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 thick i wish you could smell it through the screen oh my goodness um it smells so good i think i used this um two three times maybe so i want to say one container will probably last me give me like a good six deep conditions i really really like this product it um moisturizes my hair it it detangles my hair better than the conditioner which I, the conditioner didn't detangle my hair that well um i like this um, um for it to be it says protein power so usually stuff with protein you know really strengthens your hair and stuff but i feel like and it hydrates as well so I like that they have a combination of hydrating and strengthening in one container a lot of times I find that some deep conditioners you're either gonna have to get a separate protein and a separate hydrate a hydrating deep conditioner but this one is in both it moisturizes my hair my hair feels really good after I use this so I will continue to repurchase this last product is the multi-action leave-in yeah multi-action leave-in so this is actually really nice like typically I don't like 
gray leave-in conditioners because they're too lightweight for my hair. I will say for my hair in its, you know, Afro state, this is not moisturizing enough. I use this as a refresher. Um, if I'm going to like, say for instance, I use a gel that's a little bit more drying on my hair because I do have some gels that after a few days my hair starts to feel a bit dry. I will just spritz this all over my hair. Um, not drench my hair, but just, you know, hydrate my hair with this and it usually does a really, really great job. And I also used this when I had straightened my hair a few weeks ago um, when I cut my hair. So, and I actually think it, wor it worked really well if, you know, for, for um, straight hair. But I wish they had like a thicker, um, maybe like a, a milk or something like that. Something that was a little bit thicker um, for kinkier hair. But I actually really do like it. I do. So, apart from the conditioner, I think the line is actually really, really good. I am very pleased with everything with the exception of that one. And these are products that I can see myself continuing to repurchase and continuing to use. I hope you guys um, found this video helpful. Please give me a thumbs up if you did and please do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much. That will help my channel to grow. Okay, and we want to grow over here. So thank you so much and I will see you in my next video. All right, now I gotta take a picture for my thumbnail. I gotta do something for my thumbnail. I might include this portion in the video just because. Okay, rude. How am I gonna do this? Can I put one on my shoulder? No, that looks weird. Okay, wait, how do people do this?